Pento, okay, let's um, get this uh, shipping uh, situation um, figured out. Um, for example, let's say you want to order men's t-shirt, the this beautiful t-shirt, the DHS one, and I got all the way here. I pick a size, color, add to cart. View cart, and I proceed to check out. And right here, bam! Sorry, not working. So what happens? Why is not working? We go to um, the settings in WooCommerce, to the shipping, and the flat rate. That's what we're using. And here there is no no a specification for the t-shirts so we're gonna add it select t-shirt and here uh, let me here we're zero I guess it does will be free I don't know if you're gonna charge for t shirts or not and then um, we save the changes and then so if we go back uh, let's remove this one so we do it again Men's t-shirt. The, we go to the t-shirt again to select the options. Bada bam, bada bam. Add to cart. And proceed to check out. And there we have it. Now shipping is working. So that was because the t-shirt wasn't here on this setting of the flat rate. But another situation that can happen, uh, let me remove this one, is when you don't have that shipping class in the product itself. For example, this one, uh, the Sony logo means if I choose a size, add to cart, view cart, proceed to check out again. It's not working and you'll be like wow not working but I set it the t-shirts to to have the shipping but then if we go to the product itself um let's see gotta find that t-shirt which is this one and we go to the shipping there is no shipping class here therefore it doesn't know what shipping class applied to it so we select t-shirt update and now we go back we remove it go back we do it again. Add to cart. And now the shipping works. So I hope you understand how the shipping works from now on and make sure that all the all the products here have a shipping class assigned to them. And those shipping class need to be assigned in the shipping settings in the flat rate okay if you have any questions just let me know okay bye bye